<laughs> and he's an alcoholic. Yes. What? What? We're going to be trying some whiskey. American single malt. I, wait, I thought a malt was like a milkshake. I, oh. I also thought we were here to try milkshakes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm excited now that I know it's whiskey. Drinking! You think you're gonna like the American single malt? Of course I'm gonna like it. The question is, am I gonna love it? I'm actually not a big whiskey person. I was like that. When I started in this channel, I was you once. I was you with Dermot. Dermot was me. You've become you Dermot? Were... <laughs> you live long <laughs> enough to see yourself become the villain. That's it. <laughs> Fancy glasses. Gorgeous bottle. Oh, it's like a diamond. With creamy vanilla and brown sugar notes, oh. baking spice, lush, fr lush fruit, and sweet malt with a tobacco, dark chocolate, and leather finish. All right, Zaddy. <laughs> I don't like the idea of tobacco and dark chocolate or leather particularly. Ah, uh, they're just but notes, so Claire. They're not going to. If, if they're using those words to just generally say it's going to be smoky, I'm on board. This is uh, aged in lightly charred American oak barrels. Lightly charred. Like, lightly charred. Lightly charred. So lightly like. Charred. Lightly. Oh, lightly. <laughs> At least I said lightly. <laughs> Yeah, it's probably been... Uh, likely. There was a fire nearby. It is, it, there was some liquid there. It's probably... Pop, popped it in the bottle. Here we are. 45%! Oh, good night and good luck. <laughs> Here we go, slancha. Slancha. Oh, shit. Fucking delicious. Excuse my French. No, I'm, I'm a big fan of that, actually. <gasps> that is lovely. Oh, I expected it to be a lot... Less alcoholic because it smelled it so smelled good. It smelled so sweet. Yeah. That was deceiving. That was yeah. very So I exciting. went in, my brain wasn't prepared for what my mouth was about to experience. Yeah, that is nice. It is um, a lot uh, stronger or something than I expected. That uh, on a camping trip by a fire? Oh, I wouldn't even so. go camping. I'd just be in the wilderness with a bottle of this. Naked. Just Naked. Anyway. I, 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 I was feel... thinking the teddy bears having a picnic kind of thing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> That's quite, that'd be quite sinister. Though. Yeah, they're all Me fire. naked in a forest going, today is the day the teddy bears. <laughs> if you go into the woods today. You'll show to find Martin there. <laughs> See, because you were ready. Yeah, no, I was Problems. ready. It was better because I was ready. I was prepared. Problems. There's something not quite right. You know, there's something not all the way there. Yeah, I want to put on like a suit and a tie and just sip it. Martin, <laughs> tell me, out of 10. Well. Could be a bit early to say this, but I've done the calculations mm -hmm. and scientifically, this is a 10 out of 10. I will say their bottles are quite stunning. Yeah. Like they're pretty like, they're not over the top. They're not trying to be too fancy. They're just here and it, it works. First off the bat, Ooh. I really like the look of it. Like this whole mauve maroon thing they've got going on. I'm expecting it. Pinot Noir. Pinot Noir? <laughs> okay, okay. Now I am in. I am a red wine slut. No way. I, you get me a glass of red wine and I'm yours. If you want me to become the sassiest person you've ever met, I will have a glass of wine in my hands and be like, let me tell you who's a bitch. Plum, apricot and chocolate ganache, apple, plantain, and nutmeg and a rich raisin, dark orchard fruit and sweet malt finish. Wow. It was like wine, hopefully like, um, I want, have I had someone step on it to crush the whiskey? So, so you really want the taste of feet? A little saying. bit. Yeah. Yeah, parmesan -y. Yeah. Oh my God, that smells incredible. What? Do I just need whiskey men and wine casks? This is it, but I don't, I just really hope they're not deceiving us again because we had high hopes after yeah. reading the description last time. I mean, Cigarettes and leather. <laughs> it sounds like an Arctic Monkeys album. Oh, I like that. One thing I've noticed with Glen Kern classes is it takes longer for the drink to get to you. It tastes stronger. Oh, that one's nice. Oh, that's... Ooh, that's very plummy, isn't it? Yeah. Hmm. Oh, weird. That's interesting. Uh, I don't taste many of these notes. No, and I think I've come to realise that I think it's the malt is the issue. It's that malt that's actually, I think, pissing all over the nice flavours. Yeah. It's just like like a fire blanket is just smothering down over them and it's... Beautiful, knowledge. I think I like that better than the first one because it doesn't, it's not as... It 
it's more sweet. hard. It's yeah. much easier to drink. I love this. It's this very I, nice red I've wine aftertaste. I've never tried whiskey from a, the same barrel as red wine, so I'm just having a party here. Oh, come Pokemon on. or something. Okay, it's a 10. <laughs> Go on, sis. <laughs> you twisted my arm into it. <laughs> twisted my cork. Does the red wine come through? Mm, let me have another sip mm. and I'll see. I mean... You're not snazzy yet, so I don't think it's coming through. Yeah, I once I start telling you about Jennifer and accounting, that's when you know. Do you know what? This would be lovely. If you made a hot whiskey out of this. Oh. <gasps> Because you'd nearly be touching on a mulled wine there as well, because you've got that kind of, yeah. my God, a hot whiskey with this beer. And instead of a lemon with cloves, you put in an orange with cloves. Oh my God, yes. Out of 10, guys, what's this one getting? 10. 10. Yeah? Yeah. It's a 10. Stout! Oh! oh. I'm very excited for this. Oh, I, lo I love a stout. One time I was in here for Jameson and there was like a stout Jameson and I loved it and I went and bought it afterwards. Yeah. <gasps> very exciting. I'm so excited. I love Guinness. Roasted grain. Don't care. Stone fruit. Okay. Toasted pecan. And I know Americans is, you know, like either pecan or I forget what the other one is. We're right down the middle. We say pecan. Mm -hmm. Uh, milk chocolate and a bold dry finish. What a is bold? It? Why is it bold? What does it do? I mean, bold in America <laughs> doesn't mean the same thing as same bold thing. in yeah, Ireland. True. Yeah, here it's like, you know, oh, you've, you've done something bad. You're naughty. Yeah. But in America, bold means brave. And I'm just you know, kind of like, why does America think I'm so naughty for putting this <laughs> out there? Ooh. A celebration of Oregon's legendary brewing culture, this whiskey grew out of our long <laughs> <laughs> Go on. Start going, are you messing? <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> the bottle down. Don't do that anything. Listen to the, listen to the speech. <laughs> listen to him talk. He prepared the speech for us. We're all very interested in what you have to say. <laughs> this whiskey grew out of Excuse me. I, well, I feel like there's two different reactions to that. Excuse me. I just felt absolute bliss. <laughs> it caught me off guard, okay. Well, how good it was. <laughs> yeah, it's nice, yeah. I like that, I really like that. I preferred the last one, yeah. personally. But it is good. I mean, it's whiskey. Can't really taste bad. Oh no, the tobacco's back. How <laughs> did that happen? <laughs> oh, somebody... <sighs> Jesus Christ, it's... Christ. Did somebody in the factory use this as an ashtray on the way out? They were just like, all right, here we go. Right. So where exactly does the stout come into it? Because you were saying you were reading before. Yeah, it? <laughs> where does the stout come into it again? Yeah, maybe you'd listen to it. Was something in the barrel? Was it from the barrel? Yes, from the barrel. Barrel. Yeah, finish with the stout cast. Right, yes. Yeah. So it's it's it, they, it's it, the stout that's made in kind of the region where it comes from. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> <laughs> that one's very sharp. Yeah, which I wouldn't have expected from a stout cast. Yeah. Why? It, and we keep crawling back. We do. It's an because abusive we think, boyfriend. We think they can change. Oh my God, we can change them. <laughs> we, can, we think we can change them. We think, you know what, it's going to be different this time. They'll come back and maybe they won't throw cigarette butts in their mouth. We get butts in the mouth all the time. Just butt after butt. Butt after butt. 1-0 out of 10. 1-0. 1.0. 10. 10. 10, 10, 10 out of 10. Yeah, 10 out of 10. 1-0. 10. 1-0. Yeah. I was really glad they weren't milkshakes. <laughs> Any day that we're in here drinking whiskey is it's a good, good day. day. What's going to be very amusing is how we're going to be like intercut with other Irish. Mm -hmm. We're going to be like, yeah, this is beautiful. It goes down so easily. And me, you're, you know, like. We just got progressively sadder. As yeah. That shit went I on. wanted to get drunk. I wanted to be drunk. I was just kind of like, ah, yes, whiskey. I'm yeah. going to get lit. I'm going to walk home and I'm going to see a rat and I'm going to make friends with it. I like the first one, the campfire -y vibe. Uh, that one was fun. I did enjoy that. That yeah. was an exciting whiskey. I feel like I should have worn like a badge as a scout for having that. Be, what would the image be on it? Be me naked in the forest. 
<laughs> if you go on to the Tri Channel, you're in for a, you're a big surprise. surprise. If you, you go subscribe to the Tri Channel, you won't, won't believe your eyes. For every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, there's another video for today's, today's the, the day, day that Mars will have some whiskey. whiskey. Ten out of ten.